So as you guys know, I haven't been replying to your comments for a while now and some of you have been a little naughty. So today we're gonna do a spot check. Uh, but before then, I need your help because I'm trying to pick a name for this comment replying segment and I can't seem to settle on a name. So we have four options. You guys vote and see which one is better, okay? Number one is no offense, but. Number two is why are you like this? And number three is seriously, bro? And number four is can you not? So leave a comment and let me know which one you like better. Starting with unique questions, which really show me how special you are. The first one comes from Fizi Halim. He mistakenly read new waifu and thought to himself, what happened to the old one? The old one got upgraded to mom status. Mosando said, when you said buy one, was that for the monitor or the girlfriend? Cannot buy girlfriend. That would be illegal. Human trafficking, bro. Mojo Ichiban said, as an uncle that has handed down mics, he feels personally attacked for that dodgy comment. Then don't be so kadakut and buy your nephew a new mic lah. Varia Keys Tiga Empat Dua Tiga asks, May I ask which tripod you're using? One with three legs. One, two, three. Then we have this uncle who wrote an essay to tell us how laptops without a DVD player is crap. Okay, boomer. Okay, tell you what, now I will reply to your questions properly. Firstly, we have this Ang who is very tuned at cheating. Which size to get if I don't use a lot of mouse for any tips? It depends on how you like to grab your mouse, okay? Some people like to grab it with their whole hand like this, then which is called a palm grip. For those who are very germophobic who hover like this, like when they are at the public toilet, right? Uh, it's called a claw grip. So it depends on how you like to hold your mouse. Lah. I'm a palm grip because I'm a control freak. I like to hold the whole thing like that, so it cannot run away. Then we have a few questions about the programmer monitor, okay? The first one comes from Arun Kumar. He says that uh, he has dry eyes after staring at the screen too long. Also, he has CVS. Do you recommend this for programmers? Yes, I would definitely recommend it for programmers because they have that particular uh, colder mode that will help you increase the contrast without bumping up brightness so you can dim the brightness a little bit and then it won't hurt your eyes as much. Maninder asks, is it good for designers? It's decent, but if you want to have a monitor for programmers, you need something like this, which has better Adobe R RGB coverage. Sampar Hiskar asked me, is there a quick way to switch the inputs? Honestly, I can't remember, but as I recall for most um, uh, BenQ monitors, uh, you can just quickly access the OSD like right here, which, you know, if that helps. Your sensei show you asked me if that's the lowest latency you could get from a wireless earbud. To be honest, I haven't tested out a lot of different gamer focus uh, through wireless earbuds, but that is a very low latency uh, for earbuds in general. Like, a lot of people don't test latency with a live game. They use it uh, with a video playback and that can present very um, questionable and also not accurate latency numbers. Eddie in China asked me, is it possible that future updates will support GIF on the flat screen? I wouldn't know, but you should definitely email Elgato and ask them to support that because that would be sick. Yarek asked me if the A770 is good enough for 4K 60 Live. If you're encoding gaming from another PC or a PS5 or an, an Xbox, it will do fine. But if you're trying to game on 4K 60 and stream from the same card, no, probably not. Now to round things off on a positive note. I'm gonna start by thanking all these people who decided to buy the product because of our review. Thank you, thank you for buying the Corsair HS80. Then we have Mooklis who bought the Predator DDR5. Also this random programmer, Casper X2, who approved of our video from his bat cave. I'm Batman. Disturb Donut says that we should have at least 300k considering the production quality. Yeah, because I'm bleeding money on uh, videographer, writer, lighting, all that stuff. Subscribe now. Wanna hit 50k really very soon? Definitely gonna do a giveaway. And then we have Joseph Wiener who found our video because he was looking for his first portable monitor. Fun fact, the other day I was in a Grab uh, and I told the Grab driver about portable monitors. He's like, huh? Got such thing on me? Wow, cool. He, and then oh, he went out to Digital Mall right after the buy one and texted me. Eh. So we need to be sharing more about these kind of technology that's a little bit more niche and not many people know about. Don't you agree? And a huge thanks to all these kind people that complimented me on my singing. Including, <laughs> not to mean to brag lah, huh? Academy Fantasia. 
first place winner for the first one. I think I can change the career idea. I don't review stuff really. I'll be doing more singing from now on. And that is everything we have for this episode of uh, you guys vote like what name you like best. Is it gonna be no offense, but why are you like this? Seriously, bro? Can you not? Comment below, huh? And I'll see you in the next one.